let's take a look at constructing a midpoint. Now, a midpoint uh, is, of course, a construction dealing with a segment. You have to have two endpoints. Here's our segment AB. We're trying to find the exact center. A lot of students that uh, approach this for the first time put down their ruler and start, uh, you know, having whatever that measurement is. That's definitely not what we're talking about here. Um, that is not a construction. That's an estimation. What we do in constructing a midpoint is we pull our compass beyond halfway. That's kind of weird because we normally think that we, we should pull it to half, but we don't know where half is. We're going to go past half, and we're going to make, and actually I'll do the full arcs this time, a, an arc. Now, without changing the compass uh, length, we're going to keep it the same. In other words, keep our radii the same and do a second arc. Now, what you've created is two circles. They intersect at two locations, here and here. And if you lay your straight edge between those two intersections, where that line intersects segment AB is the exact middle of our segment. So here's our point M, the midpoint of AB. Now maybe just a quick explanation why such magic works is that the construction... Uh, produces two equal lines from this location. And by keeping the compass the same, we create two equal from the other one. And so we create this beautiful symmetry, and so this is exactly in the middle. The shape that's actually formed is called a rhombus, four equal sides. And by doing so, it creates the perfect uh, intersections to form the midpoint.